Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new episode of Ark here on our Ultimate Ark series. And today, what the hell's wrong with my eyes? They have like layers. I don't even know. <laughs> today, we're gonna be doing the Ravine Cave, which is the one that has the artifact of the Devourer. And uh, it's like a purple artifact, it's pretty cool looking. Uh, the cave isn't really that difficult, it's kinda just like, I mean, I guess it's a little bit difficult. I'm not exactly sure. We're gonna probably bring our Barry though. I think that you can get Barrys in there. I don't know. I hope that you can. <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah, so that cave isn't really that difficult, but it does take a little while to get down. I'm not gonna just take the shortcut and do the whole grappling hook thing. We're gonna do, well, we're gonna bring grappling hooks with us, of course, just in case. But we're gonna just like go down normally along the path and everything. And uh, yeah, it should be pretty cool. So I think that we're pretty much kitted out to go. Could probably do with some food before we head off. Uh, let me see. I'll just take like two stacks. Uh, oh. What else? Uh, these. Yes. Give me some of these. Grab like one more. There we go. Cool. Uh, I'll put those right there. Cool. Alrighty. So we're going to take our Barry on over to the Dead Island. And that is where this cave is located. Yeah, you're the right Barry. I still haven't named it. I'm just, I haven't even named any of these creatures. It's ridiculous. It's like, so weird. <laughs> it's like, oh yeah, we're just going to use our Barry that doesn't have a name. And that probably won't get a name. <laughs> Anyway, uh, but yeah, it's over on the Dead Island. The cave is actually not too hard to get into, um, but there's like this little water bit, and I think that from there we could potentially bring a Barry through, hopefully. If we can't, then this is gonna suck. And also, I just realized I didn't bring parachutes, so maybe I could try and craft some on the way. We'll see. But I've got tons of shotgun ammo. I actually just made up another 400, which is great. Cost me a crap ton, but it's a little bit better now that it actually stacks up in 100s instead of 50s. So we can go ahead and, uh, and not spam up our inventory. Oh my god. Hello. Let's get over here. Let's go. Whoa. Okay, we're good. We're good. <laughs> Stupid frickin' uh, Uteranus. I hate those things. I mean, like, they're really good, but like they're super annoying in the wild. Especially if you're on an RG. I feel like that fear roar is like... It's too, it's too OP. It works on like most creatures. Oh man. Anyway, guys, don't forget to hit the like button if you find yourself enjoying this one. Oh, great, another Uteranus somewhere. Where are you? You're at level 55. Uh, let's see if we can actually kill him from here. Ooh, he's, like, over there somewhere. Uh, we talked in the last episode about ideas for a weapons TLC, and I think I probably will put together that video pretty soon. We'll see. A lot of people left a lot of really good suggestions for potential like attachments and uh, stuff like that. And there's a couple things that I could add to it as well, which would be just a couple things that were mentioned earlier on in ARK's development, like a couple years ago. They said, oh yeah, we could we could totally add something like this, and then they never did. <laughs> just a few things. We might talk about that as well, we'll see. But uh, yeah, I have taken all the suggestions. Oh, we should, eh, we should grab that, why not? There's like tons of freaking things here. What is this? What does that say? New Legion. Oh yeah, that's like the... Yeah, I think I know. I think I know that. That's like the Gaia person from, uh, that you... You like read notes from in Scorched, I think. Possibly. I'm not sure. I think that's that person's, uh, tribe. Oh man. Alrighty. But yeah, we've got just tons of Explore Notes left on this map. It's absolutely crazy. Like, I think we probably have about maybe, like, three or four percent of the Explorer Notes. And we have quite a few, but we don't have that many at the same time. <laughs> like, I think we probably got maybe like 20, but there's tons of them. Like, there's all the creature ones, which is over 100. And then there's like all of Helena's ones, all of Rockwell's ones, Mei Ying. Uh, there's like another person as well, I think. There's just tons of characters and like all of those freaking Explorer Notes. I think that we could just get them whenever and just like, if we can get levels, cool. If we can't, then whatever. Hello. What level are you? Level 20. Oh my god. And you're dead. Let's go ahead and reload that. Sweet. Why did that just pop up? Why is that down there now? That wasn't down there before. I was like, I was like up here. Did they change that? That is so much better. I didn't even know. I never talked to anybody in the chat because I'm alone here. <laughs> Which is better. Oh, you know what? I hit the, I hit the button that makes that stay. That makes more sense. All right. 
so let's head on over to the dead island I figured we might just do a run around here because I kind of enjoy like the journeys through the map here especially on the ground it's really fun just running around on a creature I don't know like you gotta you gotta like run into a bunch of dangers and try to avoid them or fight them I don't know I really enjoy it and that's one reason why I actually kind of enjoy Ark a little bit more post flyer nerf I know a lot of people really want the flyers to be back the way they used to be but kind of at this point I kind of agree with the way that they changed it it's, uh, it's a little bit nicer you spend more time on the ground less time in the sky that being said I use my RG quite a lot <laughs> oh man I love like running around on horses though could you imagine if they still had the the flyers like with movement speed and they had the horses like added nobody would have used them but like everybody was using them on Ragnarok and they're like a really good mount on Ragnarok because they're super easy to get and uh, they're just, I don't know, it's really fun. I don't know why, but on Ragnarok specifically, I love using horses. I think it's just like the feel of the map. It feels like more medieval, and uh, using a horse makes a lot of sense there. Oh, crap, we got a bunch of things following us. Oh, man. We can outspeed them, though. Let's grab this purple drop before we do anything. Now, the Dead Island, or Carno Island, or Carnivore Island, whatever you want to call it. Um, I like this place. But I don't like how this half of the island is always dead. Like, can you see anything? Oh, there's one saber. And one scorpion. Like, there's literally nothing here. Like, people always ask me, why don't I come over here level? And like, sure, the other side is full of creatures, but this side is just not. <laughs> I feel like all the creatures packed onto one side doesn't really make this a great spot to level. Plus, it's like so far out of the way as well. You gotta like swim over if you're on a land creature. I don't know. Like over here, there's a bunch of creatures. Like, yeah, hey, there's a couple sabers. And there's like a bunch of Argies around. And probably a T-Rex or two. I don't know why, but I do feel like it used to be a lot more dangerous than it is now. Um, I, ju I just kind of feel like, I don't know. They might have changed the spawns or something. Just doesn't feel like that much of a danger. I feel like this island should have like just maybe like a multiplier of alphas. So it should have like maybe five times more alphas than usual or something. I don't know. That would be crazy. Okay. Hi, nice, stupid RG. Got him. Oh, you know what? I don't have any fish meat and I probably should grab some before we do anything. Let's hop on into the water then. And we should kill these raptors that are following us. There's like four of them. Okay, they're dead. Okay, and can I stun you? Did that work? Oh, it does work. You can stun Carnos. Didn't even know that. All right, let's go grab some fish meat then. Let's see if we can get a shark or two. Okay. Is that something down there? Uh, no, they don't give fish meat. There's a megalodon over here, though. And a manta. You can kill both of those. It's kind of weird how the ichthys don't give fish meat. It's so strange. Although, at the same time, it's kind of useful in the water because uh, normal meat's a little bit better for healing, I do believe. Okay, gotta kill this manta. All right, we got one. Uh, the other one's way down there. Let's not bother. Let's head back. Hey, we got a fish. Got him. All right, we're also eating up a bunch of meat. Oh, hey, now there's some Rexes. Please be high level. Why? Are they both level 10 and male? Or am I just like messing up with the spyglass? I feel like they're both level 10 and a male. Yeah, what the hell? What is this? No, get. No. That's what you get. And you stupid RG, will you just get shot, please? There's the cave entrance. Got him. Alright, so if you're looking for the cave, head to there, and then it's right there. I'm gonna grab this explore note over here. Uh, where bets is it? Like here somewhere, isn't it? Or did I already get this one? Oh, I know, there it is. Sweet Rockwell note. Ah, oh, look at him. Doing all of his science and whatnot. 
Little did we know he'd become a giant tentacle monster. Little did we know. Oh, uh, ooh, okay, that was weird. So, we should load in the cave. Any second now, maybe. Okay, there we go. Let's turn on the lights. <laughs> what the hell's with that lighting glitch in here? Look at that. What? That was so strange. I love those glowing mushrooms. All right, so we gotta head down here. And under. Just realized OBS is gonna crap because of this. Give me a sec. <laughs> Uh, OBS does not like the Gaussian blur underneath the water. All right, we're good now. Oh, can we get out of the water, please? Ah. Yeah, OBS just does not like that. And I've, I've realized recently that I'm not the only one having the issues with OBS. I've heard a lot of people talking about it. And I do believe it's something to do with the Windows update. And I don't really want to revert because, you know, I just, I just don't. That sounds like a lot of effort. Um, so I won't be reverting back to a previous uh, Windows update. I'm just going to keep with the current one because it's too much of a pain. Like, Windows 10 always tries to force me to update anyway, so might as well just stick with it. Maybe at some point, whatever issues are present will be fixed. Goodbye, Scorpion. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> That's a lot of bats. Oh, look. There's a red drop over there. Sweet. Okay. Oh no! Okay, I thought we were gonna fall. I feel like the music's quite loud. Okay, I'm gonna turn that down my end. Oh my god, it's so loud in my ear. Okay. So we should head over that for that uh, red drop right there. Um, yeah, we can get back up if we go down that way. Although, I think it leads back around. Yeah, it does. I don't have to jump across. Alright, so let's go around this way. There's also Dung Beetle. Hello. Level 145. Crazy high level. Alright, let's get you guys as well. Stupid Onik. Alright, sweet. Let's see. Um, so I think, do I have a level? No. It's my Barry. Okay. I'm almost about to level though, so we might get that any second now. All right, and you're dead. That is a serious amount of bats down there. Like, there's tons of them. By the way, like, seriously, why don't the artifacts do that weird pulse on any other map anymore? Like, it's only the island. It's so strange. Like, I don't believe that they do that on Scorched or anywhere else. Like, why do they... I don't understand. Why do they make that a change for the island? Because they didn't always do that. So odd. Never understand it. Oh my god, alright. Oh, no, no, don't push me off. No, no, don't push me off. Let's let's stay up here, please. I really don't want to fall. Because <laughs> that would require dismounting, and I don't want to do that. Let's see. Got him. Okay. What do we got? Ah, seriously? Why? I don't want that. Give me something... That's ascendant and better than that, please. That would be great. Ugh, that's the worst. <laughs> we go ahead and drop all this. Uh, yeah, I'll drop all this as well. We don't need that normal meat. Okay, that's good for now. Let's see, uh, we'll level some melee. Alrighty, where are the explore notes down here? I'm not even sure. Let's go back up this way and just see if we can spot one. Is that one over there? I don't see. I don't believe it is. Oh man. Um, look at those freaking crazy mushrooms. What happens when I do this? Oh, dude, that looks so cool. Oh, this cave looks so much better without gamma. But I'm gonna turn it on just because I want you guys to actually be able to see. Maybe we'll go gamma three. That's between. So the button, the hotkey that I hit, changes it to gamma two. That's the dark, and then the bright is gamma four. So we'll go gamma three. So we still have that cool lighting effect, but it's not so dark so you guys can actually see what's happening. Oh, Jesus. Okay, that's scorpions on the ground now. Great, more creatures down the very bottom for me to fight. <laughs> oh, man. All right. Ugh. Get off of me, bat. I'm so glad that Onik can't hit you when you're mounted. 
That being said, ArcDevs, if you're for some reason listening, I know you don't watch my videos, or you probably don't watch any Arc videos these days. Um, <laughs> don't don't make Onik be able to do that, okay? I don't want that. I don't want that. I don't think anybody wants that. I feel like that's gonna happen though. I don't know why. Uh, let's walk around this. Is there an explore note here? I could have sworn that there's supposed to be. Hmm, okay. Let's head on down. Uh, we got a scorpion over here. Scorpion. Oh, okay, there we go. That was weird. Okay, let's, uh, let me see. There's a megalosaurus over there somewhere, isn't there? That's one thing I'm afraid of. I'm really afraid of Megalosaurus. They are terrifying. How did I do extra damage to him? What? Do you do extra damage during the day or something? I think it's daytime. Eh, it's kind of daytime. All right. Well, let's kill these bats then. There's too many, so I don't want to drag them all to me. Oh my God, you know what I freaking forgot? No, I forgot the otter. No. No, I completely messed up. I was supposed to bring it. Oh, I was even thinking about it before I started. I, no. Uh, that means I have to redo the cave. We can only get one artifact right now. If I had the otter, for anybody who doesn't know what I'm talking about, if I had the otter, uh, I would be able to grab five artifacts in total, which is what I've been doing. I've been grabbing five of each. <sighs> but we don't have the otter. That sucks. Man, how did I mess up that bad? <sighs> that is so stupid. Did I miss a part of the cave, by the way? Oh, there's like a spot up there somewhere, isn't there? I think there's an explore note, like right along, right along there somewhere, I think. You can maybe check that out if we can find it. There's also one down there. That really sucks though. How the hell did I mess up? Oh man. All right, well, we got lots of creatures down here. I'm gonna try and focus on killing that Megalosaurus first, though. Okay, let's put this away. Just in the off chance that there's another one, we gotta keep the shotgun out. Gonna grab another Explore Note. Gonna grab another, there we go. <laughs> Megalosaurus, oh wow, it's at a cave where you can find them. How convenient. Where is it? I don't see it. It was like, it walked over to the cliff somewhere. Oh man. Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Sneaky little devil. How much damage do I do? I was doing 98 to him. I don't believe that I do that much damage to anything else. So maybe you do do extra damage. Oh, can I hit you please? Yeah, you do extra damage to Megalosaurus during the day. I didn't even know that. Maybe I did, I just forgot or something, I don't know. <laughs> very easily, it very easily could be a thing. Um, all right, we got a lot of Onik over here, but it should be okay. We're doing good on health. Let's just start hacking away at all these guys. Oh man, get, go. Dude. <laughs> ah! Okay, come on. Okay, he's dead, sweet. Let's see, there could be a Megalosaurus in there. There's another explore note right here. Okay, uh, it's the monkey. Nice, I love this part of the cave with all the crystals. Okay, I can't see, all right. Okay, we're not gonna get like surrounded or something, are we? Okay, I don't think there's anything here. Yeah, I love this part of the cave right here with uh, like the purple and the blue crystals. It's so cool. Kind of reminds me of Aberration quite a lot. Alrighty, Artifact of the Devourer. Sweet. Okay. Oh, there's already one back. Definitely can't, damn it. <laughs> no. Ah, it's so annoying the way I have to go all the way back up now. Let me see, there definitely is a spot up there with a explore note, I do believe. Or maybe a drop spawns there. I think it's like right there. Oh, I didn't realize I was getting cold. I didn't even realize, man. All right, let's uh, let's have a little luck. 
I'm pretty sure that there's a spot up here. Yeah, there it is. I told you. I told you. What do we got? Mosa. Nice. We've got like 2,000 seconds of explore notes now, which is great. That's an odd one, though, the way it's it's like located in that spot. Um, let's see. Oh. And took a little bit of fall damage, but we're okay. I am almost leveled up as well. Look at that. A couple more creature kills, and we should be good. Let me go ahead and drink another one of those to heal up a little bit. So now we got to get out of the cave. Luckily, this cave is like, it's like vertical, so it's not like a massive cave. Oh, can we can we jump out? Ooh, this might be difficult. Whoa! No! <laughs> uh, okay, we're fine. Oh, fall damage. Oh no, I should not do that again. All right, we gotta get the Barry out of here. We need this Barry, or do we? I don't know. I I would I would vote that we need the Barry. <laughs> Oh man, can I, can I get him out of here? <laughs> I don't want to have to build a foundation. That would be annoying, because I'd have to like get out of here first, and then come back for him. Uh, let's get up to here, maybe. Probably try to like jump directly up or something. Let's drink another one of those. Okay, we did it. We're good. We just jumped in a bad way the first time. Walk along the edge, nice. Let's see, let's take the shortcut and go across this part. Oh, what the hell just happened there? I think we can get up here. Ah, damn it. All right, we gotta do that jump properly. That was weird. Okay, we could do this. Whoa. No, <laughs> I thought it was gonna go too far. All right. Uh, this is the coolest part of the cave, though, where, like, these two little rocks, like, almost make a bridge, but they don't quite. So cool. I like this spot, and if you kind of just, like, stand here and, like, zoom out, it looks really cool. Super awesome. <laughs> oh, man. I feel like I'll make my thumbnail around here or something. I'm not exactly sure. <laughs> so, let's, uh, let's run all the way out, then. I think it's pretty much smooth. Um, hmm, hmm. Smooth sailing from here, I say, as I screw up. Can I get out of here? Let me turn around and see if I can jump back out. What is with like me and trying to jump and then not jumping? Okay, there we go. Man, I suck at this. Dude, what is wrong with me? Why can't I do things? <laughs> all right, this is also a really cool part of the cave. Oh, there's a scorpion up there, what the hell? Okay, well we can't, we, no, we cleared this cave. We need to get rid of him. He's evidence that we did not clear the cave, which we definitely did. Okay, come towards me and don't fall yet. No! Oh, there's more! Ah! Ah. Uh. Do I even want to try and shoot him? No, there's like no way. I don't even think I can. Yeah, like right here would be like a really cool shot. I don't know. I like shots like that. Oh man. All right, let's get on out of here then. Oh wow, okay. I just noticed. Yeah, let's get out of here. Oh, I forgot you guys are gonna lose frames. I'm doing fine in game by the way. It's literally just my recording software and I don't really want to switch recording softwares. I saw a couple people suggesting that I should. It seems like a whole lot of effort to learn a whole new setup when my job is like a daily thing. I'd have to take a day off to figure that out and get all that sorted or else just like quickly whip up a video. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Yeah, let's kill him. What the, why has he not turned around on us yet? Also, what level is it? I should probably look at that. Oh wow, it's almost dead. Okay, let's do this. Hell yeah, that was level 20. That's awesome. <laughs> Free Alpha Carno kill on an Explore note, which means we leveled. Wow, 
We just got really lucky there. Uh, let's pick that up. And he gave us nothing else. That's good. That's fantastic, Mr. Alpha Carno. I love when you just, like, are absolutely useless. Wow. Okay. Let's see. What do we want to level? Some some health. We need one more level to make uh, shocking trank darts. That is going to be a game changer. That means that maybe I will actually go out and try to tame some more Rexes. We'll see. Like, if I have the shocking trank darts, it's going to take less darts to kill Rexes. Although a little bit more metal, which is fine. Like, the Anki setup is, is not that bad. So, yeah, that could be a thing. We could totally go out and maybe try to get some better Rexes. But for now, I am actually breeding the Rexes. We're getting a bunch of eggs. That's a 130. Should I tame him? Not right now, because I don't have darts on me. But I'll come back for it. So expect that Rex to be tamed, unless it dies to stuff. Which it easily could. <laughs> Oh man, all right. So let's head on back then, and uh, we'll place our artifact. Okay, oops. Got a little bit too close to a uh, Uteranus. I was trying to shoot it in fairness. Ugh, okay, hang on. <laughs> I think we might be okay, but there was a lot of wolves back there. Uh, hey, we got a Daedon friend. Let's go back. So he just sent me back towards the cave. Which I need to do after this, though. Not right now, Mr. Uteranus. Oh, God. Please don't roar again. Now! You almost got me there. You die, you stupid... Ah! Okay. Let's start biting. No! We got him. Just wanted to kill it because it's a lowish level. Ah. <sighs> All right, let's get out of here now. We're almost back at base. It's still pretty cold, though. Let's pop another one of those. It's gonna help a little bit. Where's my health at? Okay, yeah. We're doing good. Let's pop another one. All right. Oh, man. Okay, we're almost at base. It's, like, literally down the hill. Sweet. Well, I thought that might turn out pretty bad right there. But uh, it looks like most of those wolves had scattered by the time uh, by the time I got back to them. Oh man, it's almost nighttime as well. It's 9:40. Oh wow, look at my rainbow! I never even realized we legit have a rainbow in our base. <laughs> that is so cool looking. Oh wow! All right, let's head back. Robo's there. Almost. Oh, we're getting so close and we're in. Amazing. I think what I'm going to do now with these Explore Note uh, buffs is maybe go ahead and... Uh, are those all incubating? Oh, no, it's just the one. I'll go ahead and uh, maybe craft up a bunch of stuff. But um, first of all, we have our artifact to put down. So we've got... So far, we have Artifact of the Massive, I do believe, right? You are the Massive. Don't You're not that big. Okay. Artifact of Massive. We've got... Artifact of the Cunning, Artifact of the Brute, Artifact of the Skylord, Artifact of the Hunter, Artifact of the Clever, Artifact of the Pack, and now we have Artifact of the Devourer. Now the only two more that we need is the Strong, which is very difficult to get, and the Immune, which I don't know whether or not we're going to do the shortcut in the cave, because there's a really easy shortcut. I don't know, we might do that. I might just do the whole cave because, it, you know, maybe eventually they're probably gonna like patch that little hole. I don't know, we'll see. But, um, but yeah. <laughs> oh man, wait, hang on, am I, I'm definitely recording, right? Okay, I am. I, I didn't have OBS open on my other screen. <laughs> oh, well, we have eight of them so far. It's episode 21. We have 19 more episodes here on the island. We still have a lot of things to do. Two more artifacts to get. Like, uh, four bosses to kill, armies to raise, armies to lose, more armies to raise, mutations to be had, and so much more. But, uh, yeah, that's it for today, guys. If you have enjoyed the video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you want to see more like this, you can, of course, subscribe. I will be seeing you in the next one. And I will, of course, be going back for that Rex and the rest of the other things.